Hello, my friends. How you doing? Um, just before I start, I think if you can hear any um, baby slash uh, my wife singing noises in the background, that's because my daughter's just going to bed. We've just been out for my wife's birthday meal, which is really fun. And I just wanted to, yeah, talk to you really briefly about the power of gratitude and what it is that gratitude does to make us not only happier, but what it does to attract more into our lives. Because one of my favorite, uh, when you, I guess you would call him a, a spiritual guru, success and happiness guru of all time, is a guy called Deepak Chopra. And it's Chopra who once said, whatever you appreciate, appreciates. And it's as if the more attention you pay to what you have, the more of it that it seems to turn up. And, you know, it's amazing because you think about, there was a study I was reading the other day, which was um, conducted over 75 years. It cost, uh, it was in the US, it cost something like $500 million to conduct over that 75 year period. And it came up with the sort of defining factor of what it was that made people happy, what it was that gave people happiness more than anything else. And it was a sense of gratitude because we will forever be searching for more in life until we slow down and realize what we have. And that's what the attitude of gratitude is all about. It's about no longer looking over the side of the fence and being like, oh, well, look over there, look over there. It's actually about bringing it right back to remembering that the grass that you have and we have is just as green as we wanted to make it. I've got my brother here right now. He's saying, how are you doing? Just waxed my new George board. Awesome. I'm good, Tobes. In fact, talking of gratitude, I'll talk about my brother just for a second because Toby, I'm exceptionally grateful to because he introduced me to surfing when I was 21. Was I Toby? I can't remember. Um, and changed my life forever because... Surfing's given me, apart from it giving me a huge amount of joy, obviously, um, it's given me friendships I didn't know I'd ever have, but also it's given me a massive purpose to what I do as a human being. Like, it's amazing when you talk to surfers just how much of our lives revolve around, you know, the, our fitness work, what we do with our, our you know, our, our work life. Um, how we plan our holidays, all kinds of things. It all centers around um, how we're going to get waves. And geez, Tobes, uh, I'm, I'm super, super grateful for that. <laughs> He's saying I was a bodyboarder. Yeah, no, I know. It was a shame. It was a shame. I was a bodyboarder for a long time. Um, but yeah, attitude of gratitude. And guys, let me just say, it's been so cool to read your comments because it it comes back to what matters in this life. Like when I see what you've written in your gratitude list, it's about family. It's about friends. It's about experiences. It's about the things that really matter. It's, it's very rarely my, my lovely shiny car, although lovely shiny cars are great. I'm nothing against cars and material objects. It's just that the best things in life are free. And yeah, it, it just, um, that's what the gratitude, uh, the attitude of gratitude does. It just gets you, seeing your your the grass that you have now as being green enough so my friends uh that is a wrap up from day i think we're on day nine and uh super thankful for your involvement i've been loving reading your comments and reading what you've written it's just been uh it gives so much perspective to this this fast-paced life we lead sometimes so really really cool thanks for your comment so loving the blog that's really kind thanks mate and uh I hope you're having a good time in Maui. My brother's in Maui at the moment, so uh, in Hawaii. So I hope you're having a good time, mate. And uh, guys, I'll speak to you tomorrow. Loads of love. Bye-bye for now.